a connection from separate sections Cause we could meet in the middle with no sense of direction If it's sun up to sun down, we mess around We're way too involved just from work and uh, this is what i've come with meat and then uh, you know i can't miss when I, <laughs> that's why i don't go, like going to the butchery because mtura is a must you guys mtura is a must see how cute oh my goodness utamiko hapa that's just 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 have a eh, closer look <laughs> yeah so i have to wow look mm -hmm. so sweet so i have to pass by there and also pick some samosas if they have or also mtura i really try my best not to buy but my hey my cravings cannot let me okay anyway so today i didn't have an idea about cooking but i'm thinking maybe i cook uh this is black beans maybe i can do mokimo for this that's what i'm thinking and meat yeah because i've not eaten for a long time so let me just sit down, eat my mutura while I'm thinking what I'm supposed to cook. I've done all the things without showing you. So <clears throat> this is some <laughs> what is going on. Like I'm cooking my veggies and then here I'm boiling my... <clears throat> I don't know. I'm just suspecting my gas. I don't know why. But um, this is my potatoes and then I want them to peel them because i need to put my black beans inside and ah, they're still far this is in a pot here pot here they're still far so i'm waiting for it to boil so that i can add the way i usually cook mokimo guys just the same way i'll be cooking this one and then here i'm just doing my veggies okay so this one guys i thought it was overcooking and then uh, so here yeah, I've just put my meat and then I put the veggies yeah not as much with this one I just use the kitambo thingy you find it so hey this food now wow I love love but I've not put you can put also beans I mean uh, maize I don't have maize in the house I mean I don't have maize that I've boiled already so I couldn't add it here Blah. but let us make this i'll show you when it's done okay so i just want to go in with the butter just a little bit of it so this is for so what i'll put in this and then i'll put my onions and i'll be done yeah i'm trying to put while i'm <laughs> holding the phone so i cannot do this so just let me do it and then i'll show you you can see my butter this one i don't know why it's not melting oh so i'm done making the mokimo you guys and you can see the brown uh, of the onions so it's ready 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 for uh, to eat and then on the other side my stew is still cooking so i added meat on the um the red cabbage and uh yeah so and i had to add soup because you see mokimo is a bit dry so yeah i think i'm done after this I have served my food and here it is. Look how inviting uh, it is, you guys. It's so yummy. So let's dig in. The next day. Hi, guys. So this is the next day. And I just wanted to take you through how I deep clean during end month. And uh, first of all, I usually start with the utensils. Guys, you can tell me in the comment section if uh, before you start doing anything else in the house, what do you uh, start doing? Because I always start with the uh, utensils first so that I can go to uh, the rest of the um, house. So I had forgot to introduce myself. My name is Shiko McKenna, you guys, and my videos is all about uh, this home decor, this um, halls, lifestyle yeah, and a bit of DIYs, you guys. So this, if this is a type of um type of content that you like please make sure that you hit that subscription button and remember to put the bell on so that you can get notified as i upload new videos so let's get right uh, into it so before i put back my utensils guys i have to wash the rack thoroughly because it's when you don't do that it always rusts and also the place that i'm placing uh the rack so now i have i'm now cleaning the uh, utensils and placing them back to wherever they are supposed to be. Flashing lights dance with fire in the night. I'm wired. 
Watch the time pass us by, here's this feeling lying Could you pass the lighter? Yeah, I'm trying to keep my cool Nicotine in my veins, flaming up to size What am I supposed to do? Cause it feels so good Feeling wild like a soup, put me in a mood oh, 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 oh. Put me in a mood Maybe oh, 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 oh. I should've known I've washed even the fridge organizers because I have some vegetables that I've bought. I need to keep fresh uh, and clean ones. So, I've, and also deep clean the fridge itself. I have done a video about me washing the fridge and the uh, microwave and the oven, but in a detailed one. So, I won't do that here today. Uh, for this one, I'm just washing with the soap water first, and then later I'm washing it with the baking soda and vinegar and uh, it that is now deep cleaning it very well uh, so for the detailed video i'll place them in the description box for you to watch to wash those holes uh, so that uh, it, the gas cannot be bring, uh, bringing some soot that it brings to the sufurias you guys so clean them up for the burners i'm uh, adding vinegar and baking soda so that this uh, like you see that something like, like it's rusting uh, it usually goes removes it very well so that's what i do and then scrub them thoroughly For the oven uh, uh, knobs, I have to remove them, but note that, please note that you have to switch off your gas first before removing the knobs. You can see that oil usually sticks here. So I usually remove them, uh, wash them, and then take them back. That's what I do for all the knobs. Uh, at least for some time, the, the oil usually accumulates and it's not that good. So you have to wipe it off. You guys can see from the second knob how the oil has accumulated. So I just use um, vinegar and baking soda is enough to wash, to remove off uh, the grease. And then after that, you make sure you just wash also the knob, wipe thoroughly, and then put them back. Please note that you're supposed to switch off your gas because you see when you open this on when you're going to put the uh, knobs back, the gas will start leaking. So you, you're supposed to switch it off first. Repeat for all the knobs that you have and your oven will be sparkling clean. So guys, yeah, so I'm done cleaning and I love how clean my they have become, yeah. And then, uh, yeah, that's my oven over here. I'm just waiting for the banners to dry. Ooh, I'm just waiting for them to dry. Yeah, and then these are the fridge uh, organizers. I've washed them because I've already washed the fridge so because i want to arrange uh, the new vegetables that i've brought the microwave also is clean yeah let me go there's no doubt it. gotta get out of this small town you took my heart from me now you're everywhere i see send me free let me fly let me find new kinds of highs 
So for the living room, what I start doing is uh, first I start by cleaning the carpet. I make sure that I've um, removed all the dirt, and then the places that have not the the carpet has not reached, I just take a rag with the soapy water and um, clean those parts. And then afterwards, now I I clean uh, the TV stand, the coffee table, and everything else. guys i'm back from town let me tell you hmm? the dust that is there i think you know most of the times i don't go to town but the time i go i usually feel this is a different environment uh, in terms of congestion dust like too much noise you know if you're not used to you feel i i don't know like right now i have a headache and um i've just arrived in the house i think it's let me see it's seven already so i was see i left you when we were doing um doing uh, thorough cleaning of the house but i had to leave because i saw the time was not on my side because you know when i start cleaning my mind just flows and flows and i will and i knew i would go to town and i had some errands to do so this is the time i'm coming back and i have to continue but i'm really tired like but i need to finish because the house is in a mess anyway so yeah so let us continue from where we um we were we were yeah uh, the good thing is that even the vegetables that i was washing i just says mikauka so after washing we go take a hot 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 shower and we come back and uh, do our veggies here what are the i want to mix this water with a little bit of just basic soap i mean just this sunlight the yellow one and then i'm going to also add a little bit of jig in this water so this is what i'm going to wash with the whole the the tiles guys uh it's in the evening and you can see the lights are not that good so i was I came back to the house uh, just right like 8 p.m. So this was time I was just finishing cleaning uh, because I had some errands to do in town. After I finish washing down, I usually make sure I wash the doors and then I make sure they have wiped the windows because I'm just at the across the road so it's always dusty in the house.
bathroom I've gone with Serazo. I've already got the Dukunchini and then I've used to view. For the toilet bowl, I'll use this Kafo toilet cleaner. Yes. But I already did the egg water in the morning. As you can see, uh, you can see the, like there's yellow and the white that's beam in the Serrazo. So I want to scrub because I thought I would do this in the morning. But this is the time I'm able to do. So let's work on this one. So I'm going in to my steam, guys. I take my time with this bathroom, but I do it twice in a week. So I have my soapy water here. Mix with the jig and water view. So guys, I've already taken my steel wool and uh, this is what I'm using to scrub down because uh, it's good to wash the soapy water th that you bath with because you can f easily fall in a bathroom. So it's good to be washing this thoroughly. And uh, because I usually have a busy schedule, what I do, I always have like, I've set aside two days which I usually wash uh, in the evening and that's on Wednesday and on Saturday so I make sure the house is clean for all those two days and then the rest as in it makes my work easier when it comes during end month so I hope that you guys you can tell me in the comment section what do you do to maintain and organize your house I'm done uh, scrubbing the tiles of the bathroom. I now go in with my basins because you guys, uh, the person who washes my clothes doesn't wash my basins. So I need to be washing them uh, like every day uh, to make sure that the soapy water that usually clump uh, on the basins doesn't. So I think I had washed these ones on like Wednesday and today's on Saturday. <laughs> you can see how dirty they are. But I make sure that they're clean today. and I'm not I don't know what to do with the lines but I'm really I've really tried even to research but the walls the tilings are okay yeah so I'm done washing toilet is also clean and yeah there's nothing much and I've already even washed the oh look how cute they are woohoo the basins and yeah we're good to go We've been here once before So many words unspoken You took my heart, it's already broken You don't have to wait I can take the pain I will surrender, let me go On a new adventure you all so much that have watched until this far until next time in my next video bye bye